purple bowl. Principal bought some stuff down for me and that was in there so I was pretty wrapped with that because I don't have many bowls. And the um, cleaner, she bought, found these. We're gonna throw them out. She said, no, grab these for Nick. She said they're really good. So I actually put them in my sink like that and I once I've washed my baking uh, racks and uh, baking trays rather, I put them in there to drain. And the principal also gave me this Cornelius popcorn maker because the other one I had was all melted. Um, and this has been named, nicknamed Crazy Cornelius because the popcorn goes absolutely everywhere. Um, so I've been using, when I've cooked with it, we got got this for the canteen as well. It's like really big. Um, so we have got a big container that we do the popcorn and we've actually got to sit this in here like that so the popcorn stays where we need it to because it's just a little bit crazy otherwise. Plus all the tea towels and stuff I bought. Um, I've only got a few here. Obviously I've been using them so I've got some at home ready to be washed. And what else have we got going on? All my tubs, they have been amazing, so much easier. Getting the um, lunch orders out, having these, that's, that's for sure. It feels really cold now, it feels like the air comes on. Really weird, I think it's just the air. Yeah, it's the air coming in from here. Bloody freezing. Yeah, I just found um, this pile of plastic, um, hard. they're pretty hard sleeve things. I'm gonna get some um, more menus printed up and put them in those. That's pretty cool. I'm just having a bit more of a clean out. Hudson's here today. He's not feeling well still. Hey, yeah, mate. <coughs> He's been laughing at me because my voice is funny. Yeah, but now. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, mate. I'm just cleaning up the desk in that. We've got a computer coming in today, so just cleaning up the desk a bit more and making some room. We're going to have online ordering, so we're getting a free trial um, of that for term four. So that'll be really cool, kind of see see how it goes. It's been a bit of a mixed reaction. I've done a survey, um, and it's kind of half half. So we'll see how it goes. But it'll be a lot easier for everybody, like including me, because you know you get you get busy doing your stuff, and then you got people knocking on the door, you know, of late orders, and it's just it just throws your whole day out. So. Look what was in the one of the boxes. Big thing of oh, wrap. I'm just standing here like <laughs> so satisfying. So weird. So nice. <laughs> yeah, I'm just having myself a coffee. Try to warm my throat up a little bit. Just got back from the shop. Um, just putting all the shopping away. I've got a bit of a mix of canteen stuff, so I'll put all that away and I'll show you what I bought. Hey guys, don't mind my washing machine in the background and don't mind my voice. Still not well. Um, I've got meat here that I bought from the Spudshed yesterday. Um, I bought two packs of these little chops and we had some last night. They were beautiful. And I've got some also a book all. There, I'm going to do a slow cook a meal for maybe tomorrow night. I'm gonna check the weather first. If it's back to cold and miserable then I'll definitely do that. But if not be on the menu later in the week anyway. So I'll chuck those in the freezer. Yeah I've spent so much money on shopping this week. I um went to Audi and then Woolworths on Wednesday night and then yeah, I spent uh, more money yesterday at Spud Chairs and then more again today. So, but um, yeah, got the tax, got some tax money back too. So, just yeah, trying to stock up the pantry that little bit and getting a few little bits and pieces for our holiday as well. So, but I'll show you what else I got. So I went into Coles today and it wasn't um, too bad. I got this big um, Omo washing pet, uh, washing pet liquid, sorry, for 10 bucks. It smells really nice, so that will be good. 
some toilet rolls um, from Aldi. I got um, some corn, a couple of cans of corn and chickpeas and I think there's a mixed beans and just like a kidney beans. I love Aldi's beans and they're so cheap. And before I went food shopping, I went into Priceline and they had this um, Bondi Sands tanning foam. So, dual action formula, body moisturizer, gradual tanning foam. I like to start using it. Um, bit of tanning stuff a few weeks out from my holiday, so I look all nice and brown. I mean, it I like I said, the girl in there, it probably washes off the first time you ever swim anyway, but yeah. Um, I've got some skim milks from Aldi, tissues from Coles, uh, sweet potato from Coles, nice big bunch of bananas, uh, big bag of apples. I think they were, t no, I think they were 350, 350 kilo, but like I got heaps of them. Everyone loves them in the house, so. A um, couple of avocados, they were pretty good. I got a Coles disinfectant spray, so it's just like Glen 20. This one's for barley, I'm gonna put that away. And here I got all these milks marked down. I thought for this cross, the kids can drink what they want. There's um, a bit of a litre. Yeah, one litre, and they're like, they were 10 cents and they're good till tomorrow. So I got three of those ones. Got a one of these. Um, this is really expensive too normally this milk. It's easier to digest this one. And just a Hilo one that was 10 cents as well. So five litres of milk for 50 cents. The kids will be stoked with that. And I've got some apple cider vinegar. I'm going to try a um, concoction in my hair to see if it makes my hair shiny. I've been washing my hair um, probably every second day and it's yeah, starting to feel really nice and soft and that and starting to grow back nice so that's always good um i got some almond milk i actually bought two of those from coles and they were like a dollar something each so it was so cheap and i haven't had almond milk for a while I'm just trying to like get back to the basics of what i eat even this morning i had an omelette with my um nutritional yeast and my avocado and that was like yeah but I thought, yeah, get back on track. I've been, I've been eating all right, but I've been eating a lot of crap as well on the weekend. Um, down here we've got some ground coriander, some sesame seeds. I love sprinkling the sesame seeds on my um, veggies when I cook them in the pan, like I do the capsicum, purple onion, um, broccoli, carrot, and the corn, and then just yeah, sprinkle some of that on top. It's just beautiful. And the ground garlic, I absolutely love that stuff. And I've got two boxes of the skim cappuccinos at a uh, half price. Got James some aioli. And I also bought two of these fluffy fabric softener sachets because, um, yeah, I've been washing my stuff for barley in one top uh, dress that I really love. I soaked it and it's come up pretty good but it's just like the material is really stiff so I want to put some of that through it. Um, I got this for barley as well inside here. This is from Aldi. There's like four separate packets of lollies so I'm just going to open this and put one away for each of the kids. For barley. Uh, I've got some tomatoes actually there for the canteen. Uh, don't mind the sunnies. Oh, I've got strawberries. I've got two punnets in them, they're quite nice. I don't buy them unless they're fully red. I hate when you get them and you, you look at them in the shop anyway. And there's like this much of the strawberry at the end is still white. It's like no thanks. Um, and my light baby bells. Um, and that's about it. Actually, I'll show you what else I've got today. Um, over the back too, before I show you my other thing I bought. I've got some eggs. Just a couple of loaves of bread. And I've got the passata. I just budgeted yesterday and the big finger sauce as well. Um, Coles had Coles? Woolworths. Must have been Woolworths yesterday. Had the uh, probiotic chop balls on special for 10 bucks. So I grabbed three of those. There's 60 in each. Um, yeah, always like starting to take these about a month before we go away just to be on the safe side. 
I finally got another Fitbit. Um, yeah, mine got stolen when we got broken into. But I love this one. I love how it's got the actual um, watch sort of bit that does up on it. Because my other one, like, I wore it all the time. I absolutely loved it. Um, but the little magnet things, that bit would sort of come up. And even like around this bit of the band on the inside, like we'll start lifting stuff. So, which, you know, it's not really good enough for, um, you know, what you pay for them. So James is just charging it up for me, so I can't wait to get that back on. I'm really um, fascinated to see how many, um, yeah, steps I do when I'm working at the canteen. So it be very interesting to see. Um, and it probably does a few more different things than my last one did as well. Yeah, so here's the stuff we got from Kmart. I bought these shoes from Hudson. They're normally 20 bucks and they're down to 10. These are about two sizes away from him. For him, but um, yeah, I thought they were pretty nice. I said, James, 10 bucks, you can't go wrong. Um, and these are the ones we got him. And now, you got the sports kind of coming up. But they look pretty good. And they feel like pretty good quality. I don't even know how much they were. Eight fifty. That's cheap. Oh, it's good, good, good price for those shoes. I was expecting them to be about eighteen dollars actually, even twenty. So, pretty good buy. James got a rechargeable air pump. This is for our air mattresses and stuff when we go camping. And I bought I know, this Wonder Pals different powers to collect so they've got little little plush toy inside of them and you don't know what one you're going to get so I thought that'd be cute just to take on the airplane and I can have a little friend on his holiday and we got some batteries you never have enough batteries in the house triple A's and double A's and Joe was whinging that he didn't have enough undies so I, I got him some dinosaur undies Aren't they cute? Dinosaur ones, pair of black ones, then blue dinosaurs. I bought that many pairs of jocks for the boys and they just get them confused. Well, not confused, they just get them mixed up all the time. So the Lachlan's ended up with heaps and heaps and Charles ended up with bugger all. Um, I'll show you that bit in a minute. And I've got some more ones with a cactus on there. And I also got him these ones that have little elves, elves, and it's a bit hard to see. Yeah, little gnomes. Gnomes, we're gonna go with gnomes all over them. So two pair of pairs with gnomes and a plain color one. So he's got nine pairs of jocks now, so that's pretty cool. Got Hutto, a pack of socks, there's four, four pairs in there, so they're pretty nice. And got my husband these chilli ones, we couldn't resist them. Because as you all know, my husband loves these chilies. And I bought this for Missy Moo. Um, cost me nine dollars. It's a colouring colouring in llama. Llamas are more it's called. Uh, it says the kit includes four pastel markers, two glue clues and over 30 images. So open it up. It's got all the nice textures on that, on that side. And then it's all those weird sort of pictures. She would love that. Um, yeah, that cost me $9, so I might put that away. Um, yeah, for Bali. I'm thinking for Bali. It'd be good for on the airplane for her. And my bargain of the day was this. This is the um, eyeshadow palette I've been using for ages, just from Kmart. And I got this one for seven bucks. I paid about 20 bucks for the first one I bought. So, and I just love the colours. Wish there was a few more, I would have grabbed all of them. Oh, before I show you what I got for Missy Me, we got Hutto, another pair of sandals too. And we need those for Bali, he's growing so fast at the moment. But, um, yeah, got Missy Moo these little 
backpack, little um, fluffy one. Got the nice rose pink zip on there. Nice straps on the back. That was twenty dollars, so I just thought, oh my god, she will just love it. She loves her bags. James is like, hasn't she got a ba hasn't she got enough bags? I'm like, a girl can never have enough bags or shoes. And I also bought her a little pineapple. Is that cute? She can hang that off the little, um, yeah, little bit that you do it up with or wherever she wants to really. And I also got this. I couldn't resist this little pom pom. Is that cute? The rainbow one. Yeah, that'd be nice for her when she gets home. She's having a sleepover at Archie. She'll be home very soon. Just putting some olive oil in the pan and I'm going to put my roast beef in there I'm just going to seal it up and I'm going to put some other little yummies in there quickly and then I'm going to pop it in the oven look how good my roast beef looks I just took it out and I took out the um I had two onions that I just quartered and peeled and then I had probably about five or six fresh garlic cloves. So I cooked most of it and then um, took them out, put all the potatoes and pumpkin underneath and then I'll just put the onions and garlic back on top and I've just like rubbed it, well not rubbed it, but just use the back of the spoon and it smells so delicious. James is in there, He's supposed to be getting Hudson to sleep but I can hear a bit of laughing going on in there. Just made a nice big cup of coffee. This is one of my Mother's Day cups. And I'm just doing my last little bits of paperwork um, for canteen tomorrow. And um, I'm gonna wrap this vlog up and go drink my coffee and get this done. And I'll, um, yeah, see you in my next vlog. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.